Good morning, everybody. <laughs> um, hi, sorry I'm a few minutes, <laughs> sorry I'm late. Um, sorry I'm a few minutes late, Lola. Ugh, pause. She always does this. Hold on a second. Lola, you need to wear this, my love. You need to wear that. Okay. She gets hot and then she walks away from where she's resting and ends up on the floor. She's hacking. I have an old lady baby. <laughs> an old lady has a baby. Um, okay. Hi, everyone. <laughs> Take two. Um, welcome to the new Regal collection. I am currently wearing... That's for that's for Bex. Um, I'm currently wearing the cropped hoodie, which is available now um, on the keepitregal.com website. I'm so, so excited. Uh, my team and I have been really working hard on getting this collection together. We decided to sort of go a different route um, and sort of sophisticate the brand a little bit because... Um, so much of it has been like, yo, what's up? I'm from Brooklyn Street, which is awesome. <laughs> and that's not going anywhere, by the way. You know, they say you can take the girl out of Brooklyn, but dot, 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 you know the rest. So um, all of that is still going to be available to you. And we will continue to produce um, more like street edgy sort of graphics, etc. We just wanted to do something different to sort of appeal to another audience. Um, excuse you, Levi. Levi. I'm doing a live. Rude. Um, <laughs> it's okay, baby. I love you. Um, he's like a cookie monster. He got it from his sister. Anyhow, I am wearing the new collection. We wanted to do something a little different. We wanted to change up the crown a bit. Because the, um, the old logo, which is, let's just say, the, the OG logo, is still available and we'll probably do something with it down the road. But um, we wanted to kind of change it up a little bit and, um, and make it a little bit more accessible and appealing to a broader audience. Um, I want to thank all of you who have been... You know what? Let me just go back to it's not so much a, a, a different audience it's more like I feel like all of the regals who have been with me for the last like 12 years plus um we're all grown up <laughs> we're growing up and so I feel like this is for us as we're you know maturing and and growing up um, it's just like a little sophisticated of a crown with uh, straighter angles, etc. And um, and I just thought for <laughs> your screen recording, um, can you do that? I feel like nowadays you can do anything on phones. Like you can do anything, and it it doesn't matter. Like it it just. It's really annoying. But um, anyway, it's fine that you're screen sh shooting this or whatever it is. Um, I'm glad um, because then other people will see it. But uh, we wanted to just create like a different sort of crown for all of you um, regals who are growing up and I am one. <laughs> so this is for us, you know, adults and also for the youth who wants to like sort of represent the crown in a different light. And um, I just, I'm really excited about this collection because it's like the color scheme is really, really cool and appropriate for these months that we are in currently. Um, I had a birthday last Saturday. Thank you all for your beautiful birthday wishes. Thank you all for your love and support and, um, we wanted to sort of celebrate not just regal but me and um so we thought to launch this around this time um and so it is sort of like a little birthday drop but um and it's sort of like a summer drop but honestly it's an everlasting drop like this is something you can wear all year round 
You can always wear a t-shirt. It doesn't matter what time of year it is. You throw a hoodie over it, you know, like a, a zip up. You can throw a jacket over that. You can throw a coat over it. You can throw a sweater over a t-shirt. So all of these items can really be worn all year round. This cropped hoodie is like perfect for um, going into like September, October months because it does have a little bit of some, oh, look what's happening on the knee. Um, <laughs> so interesting, my bra actually matches my crown. Um, so I'm gonna see that screenshot. I know, I know I'm gonna see that thing somewhere. Um, but this can actually be worn like in the fall months as well. So as we're approaching fall, which is just around the corner, we all know in a blink of an eye, it's gonna be like September. And um, so you can wear this into September, October, et cetera, et cetera. Um, and then we also, which I left upstairs, right? Should I go get it? <sighs> all right, let's go. Um, there's also the long sleeve, which is a thinner version, obviously, and not cropped. Um, I'm like, there's squirrels on my stairs. Guys, Levi. Um, okay, this room is a mess. So I'm gonna like give you a large um, image of my nose and mouth so we can avoid the surrounding areas because I don't want anyone to see how messy that room is. Levi. Okay, I got it, I got it, I got it. Okay. These, I'm dying of allergies. Like, honestly, I woke up, my eyes were completely crusted over this morning. I could not even open my eyes. Okay. So this is the Regal long sleeve, thin, perfect for summer, perfect for walking by the water, perfect for sunset nights on the beach or um, barbecues, like whatever, you know, you can just throw this little baby on over a bathing suit, um, wear it with some cute little shorts, you know, it's cute and it fits really well. It's super cozy, it's super comf. Um, so is this, so is everything. I mean, the t-shirts, you guys know the t-shirts, you know, the quality of the t-shirts, they last unlike, <laughs> unlike this hairstyle, um, <laughs> right now. Um, but yeah, so you're gonna, you're gonna love it. The collection's really fun and really cute. Um, if anyone has any questions, I'm going to be taking questions. Let's see if I do this right. God knows I'm going to hang up on all of you. Hold on. No questions. What? Kidding. Can I say hi to Liv and Linda? Hi. <laughs> hi, Liv and Linda. Um, that's not a question. Well, I guess it is a question. You love my nails. Thank you. Um, hi, Yasmin. Hi, Brazil. Um, bringing stuff to Brazil. I don't know. Let me think about that. I don't know. Let me think about it. Maybe, maybe the team can come to Brazil. Actually, that's a really good question and a really good idea. So let us mull it over. Um, will there be a physical store at CCXP? Thank you. We just that someone else just asked that and we're going to think it over. Um, will my collection be available to purchase in the Ukraine and Europe? So you can order online. We have DHL. We can send anything anywhere. Um, DHL is a little more costly, but it's also way more dependable and you're, you will get your items. When we ship USPS, I got to come up with like a real word for each one because it's like, honestly, they, they are not great. And, um, and items get lost. It takes like two months and then customers get upset and we feel bad. And it's like a dead end. It's like it, it's very, very, I feel like if you live in the U S that's a better route, but it's, as far as international goes, it's, it's just better to go DHL. Um, that way you will definitely get your, your products. Um, show us the black shirts. What black shirts? There are no black shirts in this collection. Um, the reason is because we have so many black shirts and we've been doing black shirts for a really long time. And the color scheme for this collection is more pastels, more summer vibes, more, um, you know, just like light 
and and I don't want to use the word bubbly, but it does feel kind of bubbly. It's like it's like it's supposed to make you feel good and light and fresh. So that's kind of what we're going for. Um, the color schemes of the summer instead of like fall, winter, which is definitely more black. People still wear black in the summer. I know. I do too. Um, but we wanted to do something different because we always do black. And we'll, we'll continue. So everyone calms down. Um, I'm great. Other than my allergies. Thank you. <sighs> Which is new in my life. I've never had allergies like this. My nose has been stuffed for like three months. Hi, Zach. I love you too. Thank you so much. I am so happy you love the collection. Not Zach. Um, Val Valen. Benedetti. Um, hi, Ruby and Millie. Um, will I have a pink hoodie again? Possibly. Possibly. Um, that's a good idea. We might do that again. And maybe we'll do it with the new logo, you know, and give it a whole new vibe. So stay tuned. These are good notes and nice to see what all of you are into and what you like. Is this thing still live? It says live. Okay, yes. Um, are we going to bring anything to the conventions in Milan? I don't know. I have to figure that out. It's easier for us to get stuff to Europe. I feel like sometimes getting stuff to Brazil might be a little tricky. I think, um, I don't know why that is. It may have been that people were purchasing via USPS and that's why. Um, I think everything that's been ordered via DHL, we've had no issues. So um, again, I'm gonna have to sit with the team and look ahead. And no, I'm not, I can't talk about any work stuff. I'm so sorry. So there we are. Can't talk about that stuff. We are in a very difficult, um, we're in a very difficult time in our industry and it's very heartbreaking. Um, yes, I am still coming to Europe. No, my conventions aren't canceled. That has nothing to do with um, the industry. These are appearances, which is very different. And none of those Conventions that I am signed on to do are connected to the show. We are not promoting shows. Um, we are visiting fans. And um, that has nothing to do with studios. So um, no one worry. <laughs> I'll be there. Okay. Um, what else? Do, do, do. I'm going to talk like, a lot of questions on are you going to bring the collection to Europe? So... Let's see. I'm not sure. Let's see what happens. I'm going to have to, I think I got through a lot of the questions. Um, hi, Emma. Um, okay. Mexico. I'd love to go to Mexico. I am excited to go to Scotland. I am go coming to the Netherlands. Oh, wait. No, I'm going to Brussels. Is that... Is that in the, I think that is part of the Netherlands, is it not? Or is Amsterdam? That's more the Netherlands. No, I don't think, is it? I don't know. Forgive me. Um, I should know. I should know that. Um, yes, I will be at Fan Expo Canada next month. We just got my ticket. Um, do, do, do. Okay. Well, I'll see here. Does anyone else have any questions? Um, please let me know how what and what you think of the collection. Um, I know everyone, as long as you arrive, ha, ha, ha. What does that mean? This house, I won't get into it, but the reception is shite. I will say that in this house. Um... I know. Was I like frozen? <laughs> I can't fix my Wi-Fi. I've had 1,800 people come here to fix my Wi-Fi. It doesn't work. It doesn't work no matter how much money I spend a month, no matter how many um, arrow little connectors I put every in every room. It doesn't matter. The reception in this house sucks. So it's just what it is. Um, no, I wasn't going to say that and I'm not going to say it because it's not anymore, but it has been. So if, if anyone doesn't know what I'm saying, it's fine. Like, what the hell is she talking about? 
Will I have a pet collection? That's something we've been thinking about and something that I really want to do. So what is your inspo for the new collection and colors? Um, we've never done these colors before. And so many people wanted like purple shirts and lighter colors. And, you know, I'm more of like a jewel tone kind of gal, but like these colors actually do look good on me and I think will look good on everybody. And um, it's just like a nice, fresh, new look for the brand. And, um, and so that's why we were like, you know what, let's do like pastels this summer. Um, and so that's, that's what inspired us was really just trying something new and also looking at the graphics and the new logo and like thinking, you know, how do we want to launch it and what colors will look great and doing this sort of tritone, uh, crown is really cool and different. And so you know, it, it sometimes like magic just happens, you know, it just does. And then you have, <laughs> you have, I can't talk about it. Never mind. <laughs> I can't talk. You guys know what those colors are and what they're connected to. And I can't talk about it. Um, all right. Let's see. Any other questions? Thanks. Um, we might do scrunchies. We might do scrunchies again. Happy birthday, Jesse. In winter, will there be another collection with colors that match the season? Possibly. Crown tattoo on my hand, still there. What do they mean? I don't know what that means. I don't know, what do you mean? I, why won't, why? What's happening to, to the question thing? Let me go down. Oh no, wait, they just loaded. Um, oh, yes, there was a question about the cropped t-shirts and I need to get on that, um, for different sizes. So let me just inquire. Um, wait, I'm, I'm so excited to go to Italy. I'm so excited to go to Europe again. I'm can't wait to get out of this state and country. <laughs> um, Let's see. Hi, Sarah. Hi, Italy. No, we are not doing kids sizes right now. We're going to pause. Um, we're just going to focus on, you know, honestly, like some of our small shirts, it depends on the age of the child, but um, nowadays everyone's wearing everything oversized anyway. And so you can try uh, to see if any of them would fit on your children, but, um, yeah, there are short sleeve t-shirts in the collection. Did I see my little reading? I don't know how, no, I didn't. Mm -mm. I'm sure. So a lot of questions are, um, are we bringing the collection to Europe? So I will let you know if, and when we do. Um, I was just in England and I had a wonderful time and I don't know if I'm going back anytime soon. How did you select the colors and the new logo? Um, honestly, we just thought it through. It was like my team and I sat and just thought like, what haven't we done before? And, and so this is how we came up with the colors. Um, I don't know if I'll do a German convention again. I, I, I don't know if they'll, if they're going to invite me back. I have no clue. Um, if they do, then I will consider it for sure. Um, will you bring some merch to the, okay. Same question. What is my favorite piece so far that I've done in the whole collections? Like of all collections or this, that's a hard one for me. I do love the reindeer that we did for the holiday because my my mom was like, she chimed in on that one. And I wanted, I had the vision of the reindeer and I wanted it to be like a street sort of, um, like a street fab kind of reindeer that had like a little edge from like the 90s, which is, you know, my hip hop era. And, um, 
And then my mom actually came up with the spelling of reindeer. And I was like, mom, she's the punster. So she's really good at that stuff. And so that's like one of my faves because she was a part of it. Um, some of my other favorites had, were like the Valentine's Day collection. I think all of that was so freaking cute and so well done with the shorts and the crop tees and like the bandanas and the scrunchies and the sunglasses. It was like solid. So I really love that. This we kind of like are easing into again and um, wanted to see how many of you love it and what your you know, thoughts are, et cetera. I don't have a favorite Taylor Swift song. No offense to Taylor Swift. I'm just, it's a different era for me. So I just never latched on. Um, what size am I wearing? I'm wearing a size small. Yes. I'm wearing a size, I'm wearing a size small. Um, uh, you're not gonna get accessories in this collection as of now, unless we decide to put something together in the couple days, but I think right now this collection is a collection. Um, you know, we wanna just be mindful of like keeping it small and not overwhelming for everybody. Um, so we'll see. I mean, out of this, we'll see what else, you know, we're taking notes and looking at what everyone likes. And um, is the top only cropped or can you get it not cropped? The t there are other, go on the website, keepitregal.com. If you go on the, on the website, you will see all the options. Not everything is cropped. I'm just wearing cropped because it's summer and it's light and this is pretty light even though it's summer. Um, uh, so I, I'm wearing it because I like my little cropped versions and you know, tees and hoodies, et cetera. I, I tend to go to those, um, but we have longer t-shirts and longer hoodies. So, uh, do, do, do. Hi, Millie and Ruby. I feel like I said that already. Do you do something in lilac? Is the new. Well, the new collection's already complete. So doing something in the new collection would make it a new, a different collection. So lilac is not the exact color, but we do have something close to it if you wanna go on the website and check it out. It's called Purple Rain. R-E-I-G-N. Hi, Victoria. Chile. That can be fun. Um, okay, these are just say hi, hi. Will I ever meet you when in Texas? I don't often go to Texas, so I don't know if there's like a convention or something. I mean, I go visit friends seldomly in Austin. And it's usually like when I was there for South by Southwest or something, but I, I don't often know, I, I never really go to Texas, um, mostly because I just, I don't know. Austin's really cool though. I, I haven't seen like, I've been to Dallas, that's it. I haven't really explored Texas. Any non-clothed items in the new collection? No, not at this time. Um, I mean, you can put your dog in a t-shirt. I've had Lola in t-shirts before. Yeah, you froze. Okay, I'm looking at old things because I froze a minute ago. Will I save this live? Sure. Um, happy birthday to you, SXRXH underscore 150. Apparently, we have the same birthday. Um, okay. You said as we grow, and I realized I've been a fan since I was 12. That's 10 years. Thank you, Tyron, a Brit. Um, exactly. And I feel like what we wore 10 years ago, we don't wear anymore. So, you know, um, I, you know, well, that's not true. I have some stuff that I've had for 20 years, believe it or not. I actually wore something the other day. I was like, I can't believe I had, I've had this for 20 years. And it still looks good. Um, yes, there are things that don't fit us anymore as we're aging. And so that's sort of the purpose behind this whole collection is can I boop my nose? <laughs> um, boop. Um, 
you know, that's kind of the point of the new collection is like, we wanted it to be um, available to everyone. And so um, I hope you all like it. I hope you love the new Regal with the G crown. And um, it's called, I believe we called it cross your T's dot and crown your G's. Um, which is obviously this whole, this whole like keep it regal was always a play on words to begin with, like keep it real. And we said, keep it regal because it just felt like kind of means the same thing. At least we've defined it as such. So we, we tend to play on words when we're, um, naming each item in the collection, like purple rain. And like, um, um, I think we called it teal steel or something instead of like blue steel we called it teal steel we kind of like played on words and then I'm, I'm thinking oh yeah like I don't give a crop um <laughs> that's this one <laughs> so um it's kind of like what we do uh with the regal brand so anyhow I hope you all love it I, I can't I'm starting to go cross-eyed and um I just love you all and I appreciate you taking the time to be with me and I hope you love the collection. Please go visit www.keepitregal.com to see what we have. Today is the new launch. I love you all. I will save this video and um, I hope to talk to you all soon. Mwah. Thank you.